I was good, y'all. And getting y'all back another video, man. NBA 2K20, my team, guys. You guys, in this video, y'all is gonna be the best cards y'all to be best seven y'all for the week, man. Right here, you guys can see Sean Kemp, right? I'm just gonna try to win this Sean Kemp for cheap, and we're not gonna get him, unfortunately. But um, let's go see how much it's going for real quick, y'all. So Sean Kemp, like about a 25k out here, 24k or 23k. So a good bit on that. Would have been at least 19k, man. So you secure the card. And we're just gonna go the same thing on with Gal cell phone. Let's just go see kind of like what good cards we got out here, man. That um could make some profit on. Cards go for a lot of MT. This is a guy, you know, we usually target right here. George Mirrors on. 11 to 12k range. Very good card right here to pick up. I'm gonna go ahead and get that too for 9k MT only. Alright, let's move on. Not a whole lot right here. We do have a bunch of these guys, but um, really not worth picking up unless you can uh, base them for like under 5k, I'd say, under quick sell value pretty much, or at quick sell value. Now here's what you would want to be picking up: a Josh Richardson. It's a good pickup right here. Also with Josh Richardson, I think it's about a 5, 6k card. Yeah, look. Here we go. Perfect example, y'all, which you guys want to be honestly targeting on the market. Just rare cards, to be honest, y'all. You can um, make some pretty good profit out here off. We're going to get this, I think, for 2,000 MT. Look at that, y'all. 2,000 MT, and we got George Murray's on. What about a quick 6K profit. Sam will go back to um, Dark Matter, y'all, for a bit. See what we got on the market. Game alert is good. I like about a 12, 13k card. You can definitely try to um, bit sniping him. But I usually just don't do it, man, because I usually always um, get like way overbitted and stuff. And people end up usually paying about 14k for the card, 13k for the card. Not always, though, so definitely um, try to get him. Let's go ahead and uh, filter it quick. Game alert is pr uh, price check real quick, y'all. Let's go ahead and filter that real quick. Let's see. We go Dame Dollar. On an 11K. This is how y'all pretty much want to be price checks too. For players that are like there's a ton of. But a lot of players you really don't have to do this because um, they're like older players and stuff you're picking up out here. There's not like a whole many of them on the market and stuff. So you're able to just look up the player name itself and then it comes up. And obviously uh, the card color. You don't got to go to themes and all that like stuff. So, um, he's going to be a good pickup, honestly, about 10 KMT. See if you get him 10 5, 10 KMT, so about 12 K, 12.5. We do have a lot of um, ones for 11, 750, but he'll go ahead and sell at 12, 12 K, and 12 5, only because um, there's not a whole lot right here in the market. Most of these are at 12 3, 12 4. We're right, moving along. Let's go back to Galaxy Open for a minute. Not a whole lot right here. There's just like a lot of these um Space Jam, a lot of this World Packs players right here. Yeah, don't pick up none of these. Really just look, guys, like honestly Tyrese. Try to look for Tyrese, y'all, about 6K, 5.5 minute less. Make some MT off. This is going about 7K on the market. Tyrese, Halberton. Not bad. Here's a dame. Still got a minute, so we can either wait here, guys, or we can go check the Dark Matter just to see what's um, kind of popping in the Dark Matter. Let's go ahead and move around for a minute. Not a whole lot. We do got a clay. So honestly, man, we'll go ahead and do um after we get that car right there, we'll go ahead and go do a price check on Clay Thompson. Let's go back to that Gallus Opal player, pick him up. So that's right, Damian Lillard. Name's about seven three right now, seven five. So honestly six K ain't bad for this. And honestly, you know, a lot of you guys, man, are new to, uh, you know, pretty much uh, this video, man, are new to the stream. You know, you kind of don't um, know, okay, man, how does he know all these cards' prices? Now, let me tell you all something. We usually pick up about 500 cards, sometimes 1,000 cards, man, throughout the week. I bet so that's pretty much how we have, like, an estimate of how much um, these kind of players' prices go for. We're going to get Dame, 5 KMT. It's a nice little snipe right there. It's possible we get our bids. We'll definitely um, go back and look at that. So Chris Weber. 
Like this, you know, this is pretty much what you all want to be looking for. Just like older cars and stuff, man, more rare and stuff. For any season rewind cards, season rewinds are definitely all. It's right here. Great to be bits and I think. Obviously, for like 5k a piece and 6k a piece and sell for like 7, some of them 10k. Somebody bought that for 10k. Here's a Luca. This is a nice. We like Luca. 7.5, 7.950. Get him for 5k flat, it looks like. Might have been too early, so we might got our bid. We'll see. Look at this, y'all. I can't really tell y'all enough, man, how much to target these rare cards. Because we got a Joel and Vid right here. It's going for 11k on the block. So we would bid up to 9k to make 1k profit out of this. 900 to be exact. I'm gonna go ahead and get that for 6.5k. Quick 3 or 4k. So, y'all, just in this video so far, man, we probably made about 20k MT. Just really off of um, basic cards that um, PSC. There's a vibration of the controller. We got a bit on that. All good, though. We got this nice LeBron right here. Honestly, we'll go up to uh, 20k on LeBron. See what happens. A lot of this we pick up, though, man, at 9k. So, whoever got that, man, good job. LeBron for 13.8. This is nice. We did get Luca, we did get Dame. All for around five, six K apiece. Back to Dr. Matter real quick. As you guys can see too, man, we don't do nothing on the bids, nothing on the bouts. Really just search all Galaxy Opal, Dark Matter, whatever is pretty much popping off and stuff. That's really what y'all want to be picking up out here. Oh yeah, like I said, y'all, we're gonna go do um practice on that Clay Thompson. So we'll go like this. The only reason why we're um, looking them up like this because there's so many of them. We'll get a lot of them to come up if you don't do it like this. All right, so Clay Thompson, it looks like he's going about 19 to 20K range. About 19, 5, 20K. So definitely try to get him off of bids, guys, for 15K, man. 15 16k is a good pickup for any of those um space sham clay thompson's we said dame's about 11 to 12k range we have about 12 12.5 range so yeah definitely um pick him up try to get him for 9 to 10 no more really than 10 though guys definitely um save you some room man to make some profit off of that player or any players for example zach levine about 32 probably 35k Hey guys, we'll just go ahead and honestly, man, um, before we end the video today, man, we'll go ahead and uh, go through the 68K real quick, y'all. Whatever single one, y'all. Let's go through it real quick. I don't think that's going to happen. Another Dame, too. Very nice. Dame can only be like 6 now right now, too. But that's still 300 MT per card. I just want to bother with these because you guys see the price. More like 500 MT less, it's nearly um, quick sell value. But you get it for 3 to 4k, those guys, the Space Sham Galaxy Opals, it's a steal. Alright, y'all, let's go back to Dark Matters now. Let's just see what's popping, what's crack a lacking out here. Honestly, man, not a whole lot right here, too, guys. So, um, yeah, we're just going to pretty much filter back and forth between um, all these cards. Before we do, let's go ahead and list the stuff, y'all. Auction house real quick. If I put an estimate how much um, LeBron right here goes for, guys, I'm going to say probably like 18K plus. As you can see, man, we got him for 13.8. Nothing on him. About 18k range. Not bad. That's a good 2k profit off of that. Mm. 
Merge on y'all. We'll go ahead and list for 11.950. I'll sell them pretty quick at 11, but obviously it's going to take obviously longer for these cards to sell at the full price. Sixty k left to work with. Let's see how much we can um, turn that MT into. Seven cards so far, man. Off of um, a total of 100k MT. Not too bad. Spent 38k, probably to make 20k. Here we go. Perfect example of what you guys want to be picking up. Jonathan Isaac. A lot of Jonathan Isaac. I always find this player out here sooner or later. And also Penny Hardaway. You get a lot of pennies for um, 7K a piece and 8K. It goes about 12K. Same with Isaac, about 10. I'm probably like about 13, 14 range right here for Isaac. Both of those for 5. Missed that one. This one kind of hurts, guys. This one had um, trenches and stuff on it, so obviously it's going to be a lot more empty. You don't want him. This was 5, 6K. Definitely bid. 7.5 right now. You're going to want Isaac for 5K flat. Quick sell value. It's nice. It's Chris Paul. Chris Paul is about 12K, so we're going to try to bid like this, and we're going to miss it. All good, though. Definitely um, can't win them all out here, guys. That's for sure. It's Chris Middleton with um, Grinches also. This is another good pickup. Defensive Grinches this time. 12K, probably 13K right here. Honestly, a little bit much. You can still probably make profit off of that, but yeah, we're just going to go ahead and um, leave that there. Only because we're like limited on MT right now with how much we can work with. Obviously, you got like 300k, man, 400k on standby. Definitely pick that card up. No question. LeBron is still too. Probably could have listed him a little bit higher. Usually, guys, when they sell quick like that, I'm going to go ahead and jack up the price to like 19, 20 KMT for those LeBrons we get. A little bit dry right now, yo. We still got about 57k to work with, so hopefully, um, we get through this within the next five minutes or so. Shouldn't be too hard. And honestly, you know what? As we're right here, you guys see we got about 54 seconds, man. Not a whole lot of cards. Market's kind of dry overall. We do have this Blake Griffin. Blake Griffin would be a good pickup at 40k flat. He does have obviously a contract and a shoe. So let's look him up real quick. As you can see, we got a lot up for 70 and 80k a piece out here. That is definitely a steal. And honestly, just go ahead and make a quick 5k off of it. Probably the max will bid on this player right here. Any more than this, obviously it's still profitable, but you always want to try to make the most profit per card, especially have a low MT amount to work with. We're gonna miss it. It's all good. No worries. Guys, so far, man, we got some really good uh, cards for y'all to be targeting out here so far. Luka Doncic is a good card. George Mirazan, obviously Lillard's. And any um, season rewinds players in uh, 
any Jonathan Isaacs, Penny Hardaways. I was using my favorite Yellow Silvers, honestly, to be picking up out here. Obviously, there's a lot more, too. But definitely, um, they come up later, you know. Sometimes a little bit more rare than others, too. Here we go. We got um, Jeremy Lin over here. We got a Ben Walls. Now it's kind of getting good. And Wallace is probably like 30k right now, maybe a little bit more than 30k. Nice, 21k it looks like. Might have got a bid, guys. We shall see in a minute. Ten two fifty it is. Let's go. Twenty one KMT y'all. Ben Wallace. Jeremy Lin's fourteen K right now. And he deal guys, Jonathan Isaac was like nine K. Just a little uh, you know, when all the packs came out. He could be slowly going back up. Everybody else. Man, honestly, man, a lot better than I thought. 33K, y'all, with nothing on it, man. That's almost a 10K profit right there. Very good cards out here, man. And ben Wallace is really a card I really rarely pick up off of bids, off the Dark Matter. It's usually those uh, Chris Middleton, just whatever cards, like a spam me a lot, like Chris Paul, Carl Malone, Pashku, and stuff like that. I'm not Patrick doing. I was saying that's right. Yeah, DeAndre, hey, my bad, y'all, my bad. So far, though, I hope a lot of you guys are enjoying the video. And uh, this is just honestly, man, uh, this time we kind of much, you know, explained. And uh, this is what I kind of usually do out here. And, uh, yeah, just some good cards that honestly I'm picking up. So Jonathan Isaac, he really didn't go back up that much. He was for 10K. This is about a 4K profit right here. More 25k y'all left to work with. Video is definitely going to be getting wrapped up here in a few. You know, guys, there was a Draymond Green for 24k um, early. I really didn't um, say anything about that, but that would have been a pretty good pickup with Grinches, I believe, in a contract. Would have been a nice pickup right there. Here we go. Here's Carl Anthony Towns. I really don't think we're going to get this because we need a good bit to bid. But if we were to get this, this is another 7k profit right here. Any Carl Anthony Towns, 27, 29K, y'all are all good pickups, man. It's sell for about 33 to 36, 37K range. Just depends on what's on it and everything. As a contract, too, though, easily 40K plus, 45K. Or even as much as 50. Obviously, just look and see um, how many of the other ones are up and just see kind of what those are at. Y'all, we are going to go ahead and get the prize possession to right here, man. Carl Anthony Towns. Definitely got the best pickup so far tonight with Ben Wallace on this video, man, and Carl Anthony Towns. We'd love to see it. Let's just say we don't know how much this prize goes for. We're going to go like this. Guys, never use um, min and max buy, right, to see how much a player goes for unless it's one of those players that are high in fluctuation. What this allows you to do is just save time, you know. It's a lot easier just to scroll like this through the cards then it is to just go ahead and start going all the way up to the max for a certain player 28 29k with nothing on him yeah so definitely um try to pick him up for like 25k range less than 25k pretty good though we're gonna make 7k off his towns I was about a good price for that. And honestly, man, we got LeBron sold right here. Damon Lillard sold. 
means let's uh, go back into it real quick. Anthony Davis is definitely a good pickup too. We'll just go ahead and do a quick price check like this. And obviously we're going to you know, go ahead and use this method in order to look up his price. Just because we've got a lot of them out there. We're going to try to do this quick, y'all. That way we go ahead and get a bid placed out here too. Yeah, we're actually at the wrong one, I believe. Oh, let's see. Oh, yeah, we're at the right one. But see, we don't have enough. So by the looks, this card is going for like... 32, 33k range. Definitely a good pickup at 25 to make 2k off of it. Honestly, y'all, man, we did pretty good right there. I mean, we got a good, what, 30k? 40 KMT I made off this short little video, man. And honestly, I hope uh, well, you guys enjoyed it. And then, you know, until next time, man. It's end game, man. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video today, you guys definitely um drop a like, man. Definitely um subscribe to the channel, man. If you're new, and I'll catch all you awesome people, man. In the next one, peace.